everybody. This is a Lamley preview. I just got back from the Hot Wheels convention yesterday. I'm trying to do my best to make up the sleep that I missed over the weekend. Because of that, I would probably have typically taken this Monday off from doing a video, but I can't. I got work to do. I got things to show you. And time is of the essence because I have the next RLC model that's going on sale tomorrow. 9 a.m. Pacific time for Redline Club members and HotWheelsCollectors.com. You're probably aware, so let's just have a look at the car. You know which one it is because you saw the beginning of this video. You also saw or are looking at this plethora of Honda S2000s. It's been everywhere. It's been a basic, a lot. It's been a super treasure hunt. It's been a Kmart car. It has been a cool classics. It has been a multi-pack model. It's been Fast and Furious three different times. It's been in the Honda Special Series, and it has even been premium as a convention car. Maybe I'll show that off in a little bit because it's a really nice version, actually based on the designer of this car, Rio Asada. He owns an S2000, and he designed this one while he was still a Matchbox. He actually designed this for Hot Wheels. And uh, we've seen it everywhere. It has had a very rich life as a Hot Wheels model. But it hasn't lived a life as an RLC until now. And I think everyone is very excited for this model. This was sent to me by Mattel for you, for me to preview for you. It is going on sale tomorrow, like I said, 9 a.m. And it's going to sell out. I could tell you that there's, if leftovers, they'd be on sale on Wednesday. But that's not going to be a factor because 10000 made. This casting is popular. It will sell out. Should we just get to it? I mentioned it's been in a lot of things, but it's only been a premium model three, but maybe technically two times only. You could call this Super Treasure Hunt a premium model. And in fact, I've mentioned this before. It's one of the coolest Super Treasure Hunts Mattel's ever done because if you look at the basic version, it's got a gray base. It's got some side detailing and, and uh, nothing on the front. Some details on the back, but if you look at the Super Treasure Hunt in comparison, chrome base, matte black hood and roof, more AEM detailing on the front, and these cool reel riders. I mean, they went all out, plus headlights. They really upgraded this model for the Super Treasure Hunt. You don't always really see them do that. This was a, quite the Super Treasure Hunt, so you could call that premium, but if you want to talk technical in terms of Metal base, well, you could go to the cool classics. That's where this model was introduced as a metal base, but then again, it didn't have real riders on it. So, you know, there's your metal base, which is made for cool classics. It's a neat bottle model in the Spectra Frost paint that they call it. So definitely a premium version, but it didn't get the headlights done. Look at that. Did it get the back? Nope, didn't get the back done. So I guess you could call that premium, but maybe not ultra premium or standard premium. So the only model that has the metal base and the real riders and all the detailing is the convention model from several years ago 30th convention it was actually in la like it was this last weekend and this beautiful model was made for the dinner honoring the designer rio asada and it was made to uh to celebrate his car it's not his car is not exactly like this. this is more of a stock s2000 but this one was done for hot wheels with the big spoiler and the uh, roof piece the uh, the kit added to the top but this is a great model Beautiful yellow with all the detailing in the real riders. But my guess is that this new RLC will supersede all and be the model that everyone wants. We should just get to it. I've done enough introducing, so I'm going to take the uh, protector that we definitely don't need and uh, throw that one away. And let's take a look at this model. We'll look at the card first because it's going to uh, also have the same fate as the, um, as the protector S2000 Redline Club. You can see just some really, really cool art. I'm assuming Julian Coyles did this. I'm not entirely sure, but it's really, really nice. And I like that this blister's not going to get in the way. So when I rip this off, we'll get uh, full Honda S2000 artwork. Let's look at the back. I already showed you that. 10,000 made. There's the details. Oh, this is cool. Rumor has only 34 factories. So they're really doing this. I love when they do this. When they actually, when the car is actually an homage to, uh, to a specific model or a specific car. That is awesome. You can also see that it's sitting on those, uh, what do we call them, TE37 inspired real riders. But we'll get to that in just a second. Why don't we just open this thing up? Oh boy. Oh boy. 
The Spectra Flame paint that Hot Wheels is using right now has taken quite the turn for the better. It's always been nice. But the Spectra Flame paint just has more depth to it. And the second you open these and remove that layer of plastic from the blister, it just moves. It's beautiful. Matte black roof, matte black hood. And then just headlights, taillights, and that is it. Honda logo decorated. There is nothing you need to say about this other than I want it, and I'm glad I have it, and it's going in my RLC collection, and wow, it is a stunner. I'll put it next to uh, Rio's tribute model from the uh, convention, but uh, Rio, this is uh, quite the version of your casting. I can't, uh, don't want to hurt your feelings, but I think this one may be my favorite at this point because it is beautiful. We have seen a lot of things from RLC, a lot of new castings, new developments with opening parts. We saw Brendan talk about that in the uh, in the preview they did, in the sneak peek preview they did at the convention, and we're actually having him talk about some of the upcoming castings that they showed off on a video I'll do later. But it's sometimes it's nice, too, to take a casting that we're super familiar with and turn it RLC, and that's what they're doing with the S2000, and what a treat it is. This is a gorgeous model available tomorrow. I hope you get it. Let me know. I hope the site works. We all hope the site works, so keep your fingers crossed, get on that site, and I hope you get one of ten, these 10,000 Honda S2000. Thanks, everybody. I'm going to sleep. Bye.